Okay, everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, I really wanted to play this, so we're playing Pico today. I played the um, the demo when it came out, and I absolutely loved it. Um, so I'm really excited to continue and just um, see where the story goes and everything. It's a really, really cute game. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. I'm pretty sure I have to use my keyboard, so this is gonna be <laughs> this is gonna be interesting. I'm more of a controller player, <clears throat> like I've said in the past. Um, anyway, let's get into it. Early access. Thank you for playing the early access build of Pico. Much like the town of Pico, we are still under construction. You may experience some bugs while playing. Okay. If you like to report a bug, use the F2 key. Click the bug report button. Okay, we appreciate your understanding, patience, and feedback as we work on our final release. Aw. Okay. A fresh start is exactly what I need. A new chapter in my life. A slower pace, a smaller town. I wonder what Pico will be like. The advertisement didn't say much. Um, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, okay. Seems too good to be true. I hope this isn't a scam. Now arriving in Pico. Oh, we're arriving now. I guess I'll find out soon enough. Time to start on a new adventure. <gasps> Look how cute. Is this a pumpkin? And that's a mushroom? Oh, this is so cute. Howdy there and welcome. I haven't seen you around before. You must be new to our town. My name is Taffy Bartholomew, and it's a pleasure to meet you. Is this the best place ever? Trick question. It definitely is. You're in the town of Pico. Oh wow, it's a little... I'm going to say oh wow. We're currently undergoing some renovation, so it doesn't quite look like the brochure. But I'm sure it'll be in tip-top shape in no time. Pico is a small town filled with passionate tea makers. There's all kinds of tea houses here to satisfy whatever tea craving you might have. This very tea house is expecting a new owner soon. Arriving on the next train, actually. That's me. If you can fill this form out quickly, it'll help me out a lot. Okay, name. Luna. Uh, uh. I spelled it right the first time. I don't know why I did that. <laughs> birthday. Uh, when is my birthday? It's in the summer. Yeah. Um. Uh, yep. Nope. And nope. <laughs> There we go. Um, oh, you get to customize. Oh, that's cute. <gasps> that is so cute. Okay. I go by any. I, I, any pronouns is fine for me. So, um, yeah. Just, just letting you all know. Except for he, him. I don't go by he, him. But everything else is fine. Just, uh, just a little, um, you know, some info on me. <laughs> wow, thank you, Luna. What nice penmanship. Oh, I... <laughs> you should see my penmanship in real life. You would not be saying that. <laughs> Looks like a three-year-old is writing. <laughs> I run the local post office, so I see a lot of handwriting. If you don't mind me asking, what drew you to our town? To meet new people, to be closer to nature, to have more independence. Um, I'm a hermit, so no to this. Uh, I already have a lot of this, so to be closer to nature. Great! I've made a note of that. Why don't you head inside and I'll meet you by the window? Okie dokie. Uh, do I go in? Oh, yeah, okay. Take a look around. I'll finish organizing this paperwork. Hmm. Wow, this place is a lot dustier than I expected it would be. Wait, is that drawer rattling? Do we see a drawer rattling? I don't, I don't see a drawer rattling. Um, nothing. Oh, is that dust? Oh, I can clean up. Oh, that's cute. Okay. Some dust. 
boxes. Anything else to click? A box, a box, okay. Okay, how do I leave? <gasps> how do I exit? Oh, that's not it. Oh! Uh, I have something like blocking the little exit thing on my screen. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> that <laughs> okay <laughs> got it so now I go in here oh that's what they meant by the drawer rattling okay <laughs> dust 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 dusty super dusty I would be sneezing so much my allergies are so bad y'all probably know that by now because I'm almost always sniffling in videos <laughs> or sneezing can I click can I, can I click sweet What's this? Someone's journal. Look like there looks like there's a letter too. Looks like it belonged to someone named Chai Wan. Is that how I pronounce that? Chai Wan. And it's addressed to me. Dear newcomer, welcome to Pico. This tea house was my home for many years, and I hope that it feels like that for you soon, soon too. I may be gone, but I hope you find the parts that I've left behind helpful and comforting. You have your work cut out for you, but you are not alone, especially once you receive your first spirited visitor to the tea house. Best wishes, Chai Wan. Aww, that's nice. Hmm. There's pages about the tea house, town, and townsfolk. There are options and a page where I can save my progress too. And there's some cards and space for me to keep track of my tasks. Wow, this is a pretty helpful journal. <laughs> yeah, pretty helpful. That's cute. Oh my gosh, this is so aesthetically pleasing. I, I love this. Oh, it's even got like the schedule for the post office. I'm not gonna remember any of this, but okay. Um, Taffy likes sweet sweetener and honey. Dislikes bitter lemon and grapefruit. Okay. I'm gonna have a really tough time remembering that. Recipes. That's so cute. I love this. Awesome. Okay. Exit. Taffy told me to have a look around. Let's try one of these cards out. I'll just write this up. And pin it where I can see it. Um. Okay, then I can hide it in the task tab when it's complete or I want to focus on something else. Whew! The rush of turning simple tasks into a to-do list makes me feel like I'm really getting things done and making some real progress. I need more! If you need additional help, press the escape to uh, view navigation controls. Okay, so it wants me to zoom. Okay, it wants me to pan the camera. I don't remember how to do that. I think it's, yeah, this. Okay. Um, no, that's rotate camera. So pan camera is what? Like this? Yeah. Okay. Got it. I figured it out. Oh, I should probably unpack a perfect to-do list item and maybe a bit of sweeping too while I'm at it. Oh, I was already doing that. Oops. <laughs> yeah. Sweet. Oh, that is a cute rug. Oh my gosh. Can I go to this room to unpack? Yes. Can I unpack that? No? I can't? Oh darn. Okay, so just this room. This is really cute. Okay. All done. Thanks for being patient. And wow. Looks like you really spruced up this, this, the place since I last saw it. All that dust has made my throat a bit dry though. It's been about five years since someone set paw in this house. Oh, set paw in this house. It's so cute. I was wondering if you can make me a cup of tea. Uh, oh, of course. It doesn't look like you have any tea bear. But luckily, I think I brought the perfect welcome gift. You've received a rustic starter tea set. A simple hand-thrown tea set, very down to earth. Everything you need for making perfect cup of tea. You've received breakfast tea bag. Oh, cute. You've received milk. You've received white sugar cubes. Although I gotta admit, I would have thought you you'd have your own running have your own running a tea house and all. This is all new to me. Oh! Why didn't you say so? Uh I can walk you through the steps. Yes, please. 
Let's get started. Pick up objects by clicking on them. Start by picking up the kettle to fill it with water. Okay, is this is the kettle. Move the kettle under the water dispenser. Click to set it down and fill. Okay, I think this is it. Yeah. Okay. How do I know when it's full? Yeah, okay, it tells me cool. Now what? Move the kettle back to the burner. Okay. Um, now what? We got some hot water. We got some water heating up. We got some water, water heating up to each to woe, each to woe. <laughs> that was so bad. Hee hee hee, my little ditty. Each to woe, heating up. The water is done boiling. Click to pick up the kettle. Okay. Move the kettle near the cup. Um, click and hold the floor. Oh, okay. Like this? Okay. Oh, okay. Okay, got it, got it, got it. Moving the kettle closer to the cup will tilt it more. Done. If the cup is too full to add more ingredients, click and hold to remove the liquid. Oh, okay, yeah. I should do that. Let's get it, like, right there. Okay. Um, now what? Like that? Is that too much? Is that too little? To add milk, move the creamer near the cup, and then click and hold. Okay. Uh, what about this? Take out a sugar cube. To take out a sugar cube, click the lid and what? I totally missed that. Uh, is this it? How, how do I? I totally missed what she said. I mean, what he said. Are you sure you want to add some sugar? Um, maybe I add the tea first. Take out a tea bag, click the lid of the tea, bo tea box. While holding an ingredient like a tea bag, click the top club, a little like club to add it. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I can't do this. Oh yeah, I can. Okay. Do I need to stir? You stir the tea, pick up the spoon, and move it near a cup, then hold and move it around in a circular motion. Okay. Okay. Holding an ingredient, click the cup to add it. How many things of uh, tea do you need? <laughs> Present the tea you made, hold the cup, and click on me. Did, it, did I do good? Or is it terrible? Sweet candy corn. This is exactly what I wanted. <laughs> Townsfolk of Pico love tea in a good conversation. Don't be surprised if you get visitors at your window who want to say hello and spend some time with you over tea. I get visitors at my window all the time, though they're looking for their packages or letters. Speaking of letters, oh, a letter for who? Me. Already? Wow, that's impressive. Who's it from? Someone named Chai Wan? A letter from Chai Wan? Whoa! So, who's Chai Wan? Oh, that's a bit of a long story. I'm sure you'll learn more about her as you spend more time here and get to know some of the residents that meet her. It is a small town, after all. And with these tea-making skills, once you open, you'll... Once you open, you'll be getting a whole lot of customers in no time. Although... Not to be rude, but this place does need a little work. I don't have any money. Jeez, Taffy. <laughs> That's okay. You'll earn plenty of beans soon. Quality over... Uh... uh mess. <laughs> In order to afford some upgrades, you really should open sooner rather than later. Where do I start? Great question. You should visit May Mayor Pamba. Pamba? Is it Pamba? I'm going to say Pamba. At, like a panda, so I think it's Pampa, at the mayor's office to register your new business. He'll get everything all sorted out with you. Oh, wow, look at the time. I really need to be getting on my way. There's mail to be sorted. Bye for now. Adios. 
this is where you can see your information about the tea. Uh, th that went by far too fast. <laughs> um, I'm guessing it's like the tea we made. So it took me a minute and 34 seconds, but um, I made a milky black tea. This is so cute. Okay. Guess I should go meet with Mayor Pamba. Um, is this where we're supposed to go? I guess so. Hi! Oh my gosh, so cute! Hello and welcome to Pico Town Hall, also known as my office. Oh ho ho! You must be the new tea house owner, if I'm not mistaken. I'm Luna. My goodness, what a pleasure it is to meet you, Luna. You may call me Pamba, and I am the mayor of Pico. Neat. What's that entail? Oh, what a wonderful question. Well, I suppose it depends on the day. It's quite a lot of admin work, which I do myself, while Pico is a bit quieter. But other times I host events and fundraisers, perform ceremonies, review various permits, and maintain Pico's sense. Plus, my office keeps all the records for the local businesses, such as the tea houses here. That's why I'm here. Oh, right you are. Let's get down to business, shall we? Let's get down to business. <laughs> well, all of the businesses in Pico must register here first prior to opening. As I understand, you have come here to take over the vacant tea house. Is that correct? Nah, I've changed my mind. It's like, yeah, I'm out. Bye. Peace. <laughs> <laughs> first things first, we need to fill out some paperwork. Merely a formality, but it helps us keep proper records. Hopefully you have a name in mind for your tea house. This will be the name of your business and how people will refer to you. Just sign right here. My tea house name. Luna's Lair. What a lovely name for a tea house. I'm quite sure that it will be very popular. Now all that's left is a quick business inspection. Don't be nervous. It's more of a formality, really. To make sure you know how to actually run a tea house and all. Let's head over together to Luna's Lair now, shall we? Yes, let's go. Oh, so cute. Oh my, this place certainly looks different from how I remember it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Though I haven't visited in quite some time, I suppose. What do you mean? It needs some work. I love it's like, what do you mean? What are you insinuating? Are you saying that it's a mess? <laughs> it needs some work. Regardless, your shop is where customers can come to order a cup of tea. Unlike your private window where friends and resident cats might visit to request a cup, this space is strictly for business. Bean business! Bean! Beans. Yes, beans are the currency here in Pico. <laughs> you can use the beans you earn to purchase more ingredients, teaware, or decor. Or use them however you like, really. I like to use mine on new sewing materials for my hats. Oh ho ho! Anyways, cats will come to your tea house with a tea order. Talk to them to see what specific requests or whims they may have. Whim? That's right. Sometimes a customer might be feeling the mood for something fruity or earthy, or perhaps they have a craving for a specific ingredient. Fulfilling the customer's order will some with something that satisfies that whim will earn you one happy customer. Oh, and beans, of course. However, it goes the other way, too. If you don't listen to the customer and give them something they didn't order, they won't be happy and you won't get paid. Since you already know how to make tea, let's give it a try. Uh, I think I'm good. Oh, <laughs> sure. I come from a theater background, and although I'm a little rusty, let's pretend I'm a customer theater, okay? Let me just get into character. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> Oh, why, hello there. I am a cat that is visiting this town, and I have heard all about its famous tea houses. Well, what can I get you? Oh, great question. Hmm, I don't know. I'm craving some mint. I don't have that. Not to worry, I keep a fresh supply of mint on me at all times, just in case I get a craving. Here, I'll place it directly in your inventory for you. You've received fresh mint. Oh, the kilo box. <laughs> Just make sure you take out the mint when preparing your ingredients. Inventory, ingredients. Every tea house has its own inventory. Well, why don't you accept my tea order and I'll walk you through it. I was trying to be all like fancy, you know, like pinky up. No. <laughs> I'd like to order something with mint. Okay. Something with mint. 
accept. Okay. Uh, let's see. Let's begin. Start by selecting ingredients. This is a list of recipes that you've discovered. You can click a recipe to see what ingredients you have that match that recipe. Later, when you discover recipes with specific ingredients, they'll be automatically added for your convenience. If you'd rather look at your ingredients by category, click the ribbon toggles at the top. Okay. Water. A plain cup of water. This is where you can see that what recipe will, will be made with your selected ingredients. Okay. Um, I don't have anything. <laughs> Here you can see all the types of tea that you have. Here you can see all the milks and sweeteners that you have. Here you can see all the toppings and other ingredients that you have. Okay. Um, got some tea. You, I mean, some mint. Oh, I did not read what that person just said. Uh, wow. Gonna need sugar. I don't think we have any more milk. Um, yeah. <clears throat> but these are the only ingredients we need, right? Aww. Maybe we just need mint and sugar. Okay. Anyway, let's 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 look. Let's look. Mm -hmm. You can see all your selected teaware teaware on the tray. Click any selected teaware to remove it. Okay. If you have any milk or sweetener ingredients, you can pick a creamer. I don't know what I just said, but sometimes the dialogue goes too fast when I'm trying to pay attention to everything. <laughs> Hopefully I do okay. Okay, let's heat it up. Let's put oh well let's put that here. Let's see how we do with just sugar. Oh, there is some milk there. I thought we were out of milk. Or is that creamer? I don't know. Okay. This is not in the cup. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Wow. While holding the cup, customer to present it. Okay. Let's see. Wow, this tea is perfect. Thank you for making it with mint. I should get back to the office. Mint. Official mayoral business is shortly, but before I go, I have one more request for you. Pico is a small town and community. We're like family. Making tea for beans is great, but the real heart here is the residents. We make tea because it's something we love to do. I recommend visiting the other tea houses and businesses around town and introducing yourself. As you get to know the townsfolk more, I'm sure it will improve your skills as a tea maker as well. I'll leave you to it, but it was simply wonderful to meet you, Luna. Ta da! Ta ta for now! said ta-da ta-ta um here you can see how many beans you've earned from this cup of tea Ooh, okay sweet i should use my journal to keep track of everyone i meet um and i can start keeping track of what everyone likes and dislikes so i don't forget can i open these boxes yet no okay let's go in here is it my journal in there no no journal? Uh... Okay... Oh, I guess I already put it in my journal, because here he is. Uh, like sweet floral herb and mint, dislikes earthy. Okay. Okay. Let's, uh, exit. Wow, everyone is so ni is so nice so far. I can't wait to meet everyone else in town. I'm guessing Chai Wan was the previous owner of this tea house. I wonder how it got to be like this then. 
It's almost like a haunted house with how run down it looks. <gasps> rattle, rattle. Eek! Maybe it's more haunted than I thought. Uh, I I'm sorry for calling your tea house run down. It's actually very char charming. Oof. Up here. In the teapot. Okay. Oh my god, so cute! <laughs> Phew, wow. Hi, it's been a while since I've said hi to anyone. Are you a ghost? A ghost? That's silly. Don't be scared. I'm here to help you. Maybe you've heard of me. Um, or maybe one of my cousins? Uh-uh. <sighs> Sigh. <laughs> well, I'm a tea sprite. Oh. Yeah, cool, right? Um, totally. I wanted to say hi and introduce myself. Tea sprites are all over Pico. Each tea house has their very own patron tea sprite. And, great to meet you. Oh, I'm yours. <laughs> oh, I have my own little tea sprite. Great to meet you. Oh, wow. It is great to meet me, isn't it? <laughs> what should I call you? I'm... Oh. Hmm. Hmm, I don't actually remember my name. I was asleep for a really long time. So long, in fact, it feels like like time completely stopped. A lot seems to have changed around here. It's a little more run down than I remember. I've been here a long time though. I helped the, I helped the previous owner. Chaiwan? Yeah. She left me a note. How'd you know? She left me a note. Ghost note? Just a regular note. Oh, I guess she read it before she passed away. Well, I'm here to help and assist you on your team-making journey here in Pico. And I'd love it if you could give me a name, you know, something to call me by, besides, hey you, or Teapot Ghost. I kind of like Teapot Ghost. Uh, what should our tea sprite name be? Um, uh, I don't know. <laughs> Floof. Floofer. Yeah, there we go. Floofer. No. How about, um... Spoop... Sp uh, spooper? How about Spooper? Yeah, we're gonna go with Spooper. <laughs> wow, Spooper! What a unique name for a unique me! Now that we're so close, I figured I'd let you in on a little secret. Secret? Secret's a strong word. A tip, more like. Anyways... What I wanted to talk to you about is tea points. What are tea points? I'm so glad you asked. <laughs> tea points are super important. With every cup of tea, you generate energy with your intent. We refer to them as tea points, which are affected by the ingredients you use and who you make it for. Your tea points help to support and sustain your tea house and the town. Any questions so far? Uh, uh nope. Neat, huh? So, uh, not to be rude or anything, Go on. We really need some tea points so we can get some upgrades here. ASAP. I want you to collect 50 tea points. Don't worry, it'll be easy. Easy teasy. <laughs> we'll start bright and early in the morning. Say, while you were gone, one more package got delivered for you. I took a peek in the box. It's a pillow. Why don't you click on your bed to call it a day? Who knows what tomorrow will bring. Bye for now, and see you soon, Luna. <gasps> okay. It is Sunday, day one of spring. Dun, 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 dun. When we exit. I think I have more than 50 tea points, don't I? Well, anyway, let's go see how happy. Good morning, Luna. I love the morning. <laughs> Getting up bright and early makes me excited for the possibilities of the day ahead. How about you? Are you a morning person? Oh gosh, no. Absolutely not. Sleeping in can be good too. But it's your first full day here in Pico and I'm sure you want to explore. You were asking about a letter from Chai Wan yesterday, right? If you want to learn about her, Min would be a good person to ask. She should be at her tea house now. Oh, that reminds me. Something arrived for her. Her niece, Bong Cha, was supposed to be pick it up. If you're going by anyways, would you drop off a package for me? Ugh, tasks. <laughs> sure. Thanks a bunch. Here you go. 
Okay. I really gotta run now. If you've got time later, you should stop by the post office. My mail route takes me all over Pico, so it can be tricky to find me. But if you ever want to check when I'll be home, look at the schedules in your journal. You can also see when my little shop is open. Come by next time you see to restock on ingredients. Talk in a bit. Bye. Congratulations. You are now a full-fledged resident of Pico. Time will start passing from this point forward. You're free to explore the town, meet your neighbors, and make tea. Ooh. Okay, guys. Well, then I think I'm going to stop here. I know it was a short video. I'm sorry. It's just lately I, I feel like I need to make them a little shorter just for um, it, my health. <laughs> sorry. I, I, re I really am. But, um, yeah, some of my videos are going to just be a little shorter here and there every once in a while. Um, I hope that's okay with you guys. Uh, but we finished the tutorial, I guess, basically, in this first video. Um and I can't wait to play more. Um, just let me know if you want to see another video of this, okay? Um, and I'll see you all in the next video, okay? Bye!